Hi guys, Rick Damuth here at Cowtown USA. We're located about, uh, oh, probably close to 100 miles southwest on Interstate 44 of St. Louis. Uh, about three hours from Branson, about two hours from Springfield, Missouri. I've got here today a Murhau trailer. Now, a lot of people don't know who this company is, but this is the oldest manufacturer of horse trailers in the United States. 60, over 65 plus years. It is an all aluminum trailer. And here's, the folks that are buying these are, are uh, guys who have been there and done that. They know what it, uh, the quality of this trailer. It's all aluminum frame, all aluminum floor. But it's set up basically to haul, haul horse, horses. <coughs> but instead of doing that, we've converted into and ordered as a toy hauler. So I'm saying that to say this, if it's strong enough to haul 1,000, 1,500 pound horse that wants to kick and jump up and down, all, all that means is the longevity of the, of, of the unit. Uh, you can see it's armor plated from front to back. You look underneath, and I'll take you underneath this. It's probably gonna be a lengthy video, but but this is what people are buying. Let me slip down here and I'll show you under the belly of the beast of this. Let's slip down here and show you this. I want to show you how close the braces are. That's uh, four inch eye beam and then you got your one inch interlocking floor guys it's probably about one inches apart so you have uh, and to put that perspective there are a lot of these trailers that have no structure running lengthways so this trailer is going to have a hundred supports uh, running lengthways that a lot of them have none now this is a sold trailer it is an ordered trailer uh, so it's going to give you some ideas. We keep them in stock, but but they're all basically different. Okay, this has got your dual awnings on it, all both power, and they have the the uh, aluminum wrap on them called Weather Guard. This has got your three seven thousand pound axles. Uh, now going the seven thousands gives us some extra room between the axles. I think these fenders in here are. Uh, 82 inches wide. If we do the 8,000 pound axles, that doesn't happen. Okay, you're fully insulated, fully lined. Got your escape door and the tracking here in the floor. We can order this with beds in the back, uh, couches, uh, tables. You know, again, this is this one is sold special ordered. Get your generator up on the roof. Got a nice swing out ladder here. Instead of scurrying up the side like a gray squirrel, brown squirrel, you can actually go up the ladder like a human. Okay. Now he's actually ordered an extra box here. You saw it inside, like a cabinet, more storage, place to put his cable. Now this has dual air conditioners on it. Um, let me. Go ahead and walk you through this. Put your power slide on it. Upgrade dual hydraulic jacks. Uh, locking aluminum battery box. That just means your batteries stay your batteries. This has got uh, a 5.5 gasoline generator on it. Had to be upgraded uh, to have your dual air conditioners on it. Let me take you inside. First thing you're going to see is your theater seating. A nice set of steps up into the bedroom. Let me go in here and close this door so it'll actually show you what it looks like. Alright. Let me step over here. A nice wide set of steps. This is set up with what's called the farmhouse interior. 
So I'm just going to give you a view from the from the bedroom. Theater seating. Dinette that makes into a bed. Again, I, if I didn't mention, I will mention it is a farm farmhouse interior. This is not this is not real common. This just is a, it is an offering that that Murhow makes. Kind of be slow around here so you can kind of see what we're doing. Let me take you up here in the bedroom. Extra flat screen TV over the bed, storage over the bed, storage over the top of the bed. Again, this is all solid wood. There is no vinyl, there is no everything in here is solid. Okay, take you down the steps. I do like the steps and the armrail. And I'm going to take this. They call this solid countertop. I don't know exactly what that means, but I do know that's, that's what people like. It's got the farmhouse kitchen in it. They like that too. It's got your upgrade into to your convection microwave quite a bit better uh, that your gas stove down here but you do not have to have a gas oven with this lots of drawers of storage so let's see what we got here okay step back here so you can see this I'm going too slow for some of y'all and some too fast, but anyway. You spend this kind of money, you kind of like to see what you're getting. Now this has got your hardwood covers. This is over your speaker and this is over your air conditioning. And this covers your air conditioning. That's It's that way throughout. It does have a six foot slide out. What do you think about the light? And I'll take you take you back a little bit, hadn't it? I guess I should take you and show you. Probably looked over. You guys probably seen it without me mentioning it. But you got the same type of lighting over each side of the bed. You got 110 plug-ins over on each side of the bed and light switch. Okay. Got a full-length mirror here. It's probably runs it, and you have 110 plug-in down here as well. Okay, you got 110 here, and you got your USB there. Place to charge your phone. I think that's what it's called. Okay, you got your day and night individual shades here, and then you can see the solid wood. How thick that is, guys. That is. Let me give you a perspective here. That's probably an inch, inch and a quarter, maybe even an inch and a half thick. Backsplash. Alright, let me show you this door here. Again, this is called the farmhouse interior. I'll go through here and give you a shot of what it looks like. back in here so I can give you it's solid door solid wood got your yeah hang on a second guys got your hammered sink got your under counter lighting Okay, got your nice frosted glass, round radius shower. Okay, let me spin around here for you. Nice big hanging closet. Does have your max air fan. You can set the temperature here. This will automatically open. 
and clothes. You can, you can go in the living quarters and uh, get you some good cross ventilation, kind of like an attic fan. Guys, this is pretty cool. Looks like sawmill wood. Same way the floor. This is just pretty cool. Got your upgraded porcelain stool. This is the top side of your storage, so your workbench. 110 plug in here. Second air conditioner here. Tie downs all through here. I can tell you guys, it's, this, is a, this is a nice unit. If you're looking to buy something cheap, this ain't, this ain't it. I don't guess that's really a good word to use, but it still ain't it. Didn't change a thing. You got your taillights low. You got your taillights high. All that does is tells the semi that's back three or four cars behind you, you're fixed to stop. I don't know what else I can tell you about it. It's good quality. Uh, we try to keep a, a living quarter, a living quarter toy hauler in here all the time. Uh, it won't be exactly like this one unless you order it like this one, as far as length. Uh, in fact, I'll give you that while we're while we're talking about this. Let's go back in here. There was quite a bit on this this one that couldn't keep up with it all. Let's see here. This particular one is 17 feet, what they call a short wall. Let's show you here. 17 feet on the short wall. That's here to here. And then in the back, from here to here, it says it's 20 foot 6 inches. And then on from here to here, it's 16 feet. So I th that's that might be more details than what you want, but I like I like for people to know. So anyway, guys, uh, just tell me what you're thinking. There's the inside of that door, what it looks like, and we've got different floor plans, different lengths. You know, obviously this this man knew what he wanted and we built it to suit him so give us a call 573-885-6300 I'll tell you what we've got coming in and what we can do for you 573-885-6300 or go on our website cowtownusainc.com thank you